Is there something I can help you with? Mr. Adley. Edgar Adley. Uh, no. No, I don't think so. Blast Milo and his mad schemes. Milo? He was my friend. Came to me a few days ago with a brilliant plan to make some quick galleons. All I had to do was follow him into the Forbidden Forest. They had known he wanted to procure venom from a living acromantula. Oh, poor Milo. He didn't deserve to go like that. No, he didn't. I'm very sorry to hear about your friend. Oh, thank you. I can't think of it. Milo's body is still in that cave with the absconder. The absconder? Aye, uh, Milo's name for the Acromantula. He did have a flair for the dramatic. In fact, as he died, Milo begged me to take his heirloom pocket watch so that his daughter would have something to remember him by. But I... I fled. If I have time, I can try to collect the heirloom watch, Mr. Adley. You can't possibly go to the Acromantula's cave. You'd be killed. Please, forget I said anything. Acromantula. The Absconder. Oh, where could the Acromantula cave be? Right. Hmm. I've done five. That means I probably need to go back so I can get more, so I can explore more. You know? Because I actually did do some puzzles. Sweet. If only I could sell some ingredients, eh? That'd be just fine. Some dead <laughs> is flying flip hindu flip hindu the dindu oh crap some straight up flying goggles yeah I like it I mean anything's better than those crappy ones she doesn't have any hat, so they're like, this is the most incredible hat, check it out. And I'm like, ugh. <laughs> Alright, let me see that. Fine. Over here. Eh. Flying mountains, wow. And I have 172 bucks and basically nothing. Hmm. 
I hate it. I don't like it. I don't like all the. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Hmm. I'd like the room to be warm and comfortable. As if I'm floating inside Yeah, I don't want so butter. many floating particles. Mm, sounds perfect. I'm seeing a lot of stuff. Mm, nope. Yeah, no, I was not having it. Where is good old Professor Garlic? She likes me at least. What's this? She's like the only one who's gotten her stuff progressed. I mean, you can't imagine how like potions and herbology kind of go together, and it feels like the only thing I've really gotten to do is get a pretty decent collection of like potion ingredients together. Perhaps a hybrid. I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, well if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants well, thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Flipendu. Wonderfully done. If you'd like. What does it do? You're welcome to do so here. You're in the Is that all it does? Huh. Yeah, just flipendu. Professor Garlic, a moment of your time? The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. Hmm. I was wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask! I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Well, he never cared. Really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised so how him. <laughs> you got hit with a cactus, uh, 10,000 needles. Trouble began one day when he cut into a wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You may recall the marvelous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely, but wow. terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Well, not quite. After oh three God. weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit With of his, his eyes. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Okay. In a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for him. Good God. <laughs> Fair bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well... I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a 
particularly temperamental venomous tentacular. That would take him. I was thinking that was next. His resulting leave of absence continues to this day. Sounds right. I'm glad everything worked out as it did, and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do I love do. these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your wigan trees. Right? Might have a bow truckle. Rip your eyeballs out. I guess that's the moral of this story. Gonder's cave, eh? Nin? Hey, ah, oh, men. Oh my gosh. Just getting fringe finish over there. Ginger. Oh my god. Wow, we really did wipe out a lot of them. Like all of this, just kind of swooped it out. Now, I think I'm close to actually getting that, which I'm looking forward to. Five more. I'm willing to do five more. And then let's do a main quest. It's time. Hmm. How come I can't do this? Tough skins. Buff skins are great. I want some buff skins. Ben! What are you doing over there? How nice to see you, my young friend. Puff skins. Ben, Ben. <laughs> Den one. What do you think of? No, no, you just relax. Just relax your goodness. Got so much dental fury here. It's like men now. Just relax. Mm. Okay. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. So I see one. Um, see two. Let's see the third one. Ginger, what is it? Okay, one, two, that's it. Okay, one, two, three. Oh, the third one's way, way back there. Okay, maybe right here, on top of this rock. This might be the spot. Nope, oh, right there. Don't be a jerk. Get off. Okay, this should work. Perfect. Trial when I see one. Bam. Oh, 
four left, including this one. Oh god, there's the giant boulder. There's the platform. Oh shit. These are kind of the worst. Oh my god. No. Wow. So it's pretty important to not muss that up. Oh my god, no. No, 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 no. 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 actually where it's supposed to go. Because I'm skeptical. And just do that. Yeah. I think that'll do it. Yeah, it's struggling to do the right thing, but it's going to do it. Huh. Kind of interesting. It's such an easy one. Like, you just get to watch. Kind of rare. Like golfing. Oh, a hole in one. Nice. That was just satisfying, Merlin. That wasn't even hard. You were just having fun. What's this one? Completely separate. Really? That's why it looked like there was stuff so close together. It kind of was. Oh. Oh. What? What's going on down there? What? What are you hiding in here? Just let me off. Don't, don't be difficult. Come on, just let me off of there. Come on, come on, come on. Like this is just plain mountain. Just, you know what? I don't need this shit. I'll do this one. I only need three more. I say need in the most general terms. I don't. I don't even need these. I'm just getting these because I feel like it. This place is useful for the purpose. Bam, my Alice sweet. Wait, what? Rebellion. <gasps> oh. This one already got started, even. I'm glad it was already started, and you didn't actually have to throw more Malice Wheat down on it. That's a nice touch. I definitely thought I was gonna have to do that. Huh. Looks like we're actually kind of out of those. Like, that area is kind of decimated. We'll go down here.
which is what it is, you know, I was expecting to get to tear it up a little bit, rip it up a little bit, you know, I was excited, I was, I was, I was like, yas queen, you know, I was like, yas, with three A's, yas, I said, but no, we're not ready, not ready for that power, we can do one E, yes, <laughs> it's okay. I'm excited. I might order a burrito. We'll see. Celebratory burrito. My life isn't over yet, burrito. Could it be a Mallow tribe? Mallow sweet go. Ah, uh, where's the jiggle? Ah, uh, ooh, I like these ones. Easy. Just fire away. Too bad, because these are actually kind of pretty. But the little gazebo that's left in its place is also very pretty, so I'd say it kind of balances out. Is there any more? Huh. I gotta be missing one. What's that? Gotcha. <laughs> That's a good one. He hit a rock in front of it. That was pretty good. You gotta give him on that one. That was a nice little trick. A little fake out there. Nice. We're close. Let's see. How about this one? I love a good puzzle. Mellow sweet. Yeah. Let's fix your goggles. They're bothering me. Then again, we are really zooming. Feels like the most appropriate time to do this is when I'm just racing around like this. Oh. Okay. Everyone, don't get alarmed. Rebellion. The last one. Oh. Beautiful. Who doesn't want a beautiful gazebo? Made by Merlin. Made the land better. And the torches get to stay lit. That's an added benefit. Now, what's going on in here? Is there a store? There is one store. And it's this tent here. Hello. See if there's something indeed. You have the Sky Scythe. It's pretty neat. Don't want this. I shall hope to do business with you again. Definitely don't want this. Thank you kindly. That's been a pleasure. Well, we both win. No. Last one. Oh, it's on the beach. I know what that means. Malin trial. Ooh, these ones are actually pretty good. Right, let's see. First. Second. Third. Oh, you messed it up. One, two, three, four. Ah, she messed it up. Oh, do it again. One, two, three, four, five. Got it. Aha. And that would be the one. That should extend my inventory quite a bit. Like, really, step off. You know, is kind of what I'm asking the game to do, is just step off 
my inventory space there. Yeah, that's that's pretty big. I mean, really, come on, leave me alone. You know, it's almost maxed. I hope. What's this? Oh, five sets of balloons. Oh, ten sets of balloons. The lickety swift. Huh. Well, I am pretty far. I can honestly say that. I've, I've collected a lot. And, dang, look how many more there are to collect out there. Um, money-wise, how is we money-wise? We are... Yeah. We are, ah, 429. So, that's not terrible, that's not great. Takes like a thousand to get me a new plant to grow. If I was really endeavoring towards something special, I would love to get a pet or something like that. But they don't seem to be selling, you know? It's like right here, the brew and pack. Here, let's go check it out. Actually, let's just go and check it out. Let's see what they have to say for themselves. Why have they been closed for a month? Get any more cozy Maybe than more. Is it level locked? Of course it does. Fine. Let's go and do the main quest. I doubt there's anything that it could possibly do to stop us at this point. I find this area better. And look what it's next to. Why, I do believe. Yep, that's a mallow sweet. Who's that kitty hiding in the bushes? Who's that kitten? Hiding over there on that chair, man. I'm close enough, I don't even mind walking. Alright, let's make a nice leisurely stroll over to the location. Kill some leeches on the way there. Squeeze those out. Who's that? Oh, just critters? I don't care. Here we are. There you are. Uh, let me optimize. Um, hmm. I suppose like that. I like that. And then, yeah, it's good. Hello. We're not alone. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists 
Around a dozen, I can see. There could down. be more. Could we operate pulls them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Wow, well, this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. And I'd suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. No sense in announcing our arrival. Okay, wait. Do I have the thing? Yeah, okay. It's time. What's this? For each chumping cabbage thrown, a second cabbage is generated at no cost. What the? Huh. Weird. No, what I'm looking for... Is this... New spell set. Yeah, this is the only other one. Well, that's disappointing. Alright, this is more of a stealth build. So we'll go with this. 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 How about this? Makes sense. What happened? Why aren't you being sneaky at all? I mean, they're right there. Now. Right? You could have tried to do that sooner, I was telling you. I know how to do it. Do you think this is my first stealth mission? Holy shit, I am way late for coming out here. Suit me, sitting around all day. Must be something here. Ramrock said so. There must be something here. Ramrock said so. Yeah, but Ramrock's a moron. Look at the people he hires. Should see anything I should know about. Right. Gold snake scarf. Love that. Over here. Come, 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 come on. All right. What are we doing? Because there is no goblin presence anymore. We just annihilated him. Thus ending the goblin presence. Done. Good job, guys. Mission accomplished. <laughs> right? Like, done. We did it. We're champions. Goblin presence. 
You know where we're supposed to be going? Because I don't. <clears throat> Excuse me. And sneeze. Mm. No. Goblin present. Revelio. Don't see it. I'm seeing something blue. Who poke that? That's interesting. What do you think, Doc Fig? I don't have any ideas. Well, you asked me to find solutions. This building is clearly barred. We need to go inside. God, what do you fucking want from me? see anything dude investigate goblin presence Revelio. coincidence what do they know about the tower look for evidence why they are here it's like weapons And sleep in uh, bunk beds, which is kind of funny. Go. What's this? Is this a note? It's all contingent on me finding this. It? Directly from Ranrock. Yep. I made all the difference. I will draw blood. What's that? Those are the Looks like we found the entrance. Revelio. Bard. It's locked. What? 
My dude, teach me that. Very handy. No time now, but if you don't learn it soon, we can work on it back at the castle. That did help a lot. Welcome to San Bacar's Tower. Oh, it's okay. Hello, Professor. Did you say San Bacar's Tower? I did. Professor Bacar is a keeper you have yet to encounter. I'm glad to see that I was correct in presuming that we would meet again soon after our last encounter. No, I surmise based on the commotion I heard that you did not have an easy time getting to me. We did not, Professor. We encountered goblins outside the tower. That goblins were aware of my vault is disquieting enough. But if they have also made a connection to this tower, then the threat may be greater than I thought. All the more reason for us to move forward. Downstairs, near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Commanded to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. As Professor Fig cannot join you, he and I will, in time, see you back at the map chamber. Remember what you see. We're going to need to understand how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. For the moment, however, you've more important things to set your mind to. Not a really. reservoir of ancient magic, I believe. Yes, sir. Like then that. I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. Thank you. That said, be careful. I will, sir. Teach me that I'll unlocked door spell. Separated. The reservoir of ancient magic. Downstairs, near the entry. Relax. Percival Ratton Trial. Hmm. planned for me, but let's take a look. Up I've bit. seen this before. In Gringotts and the restricted section. Pretty cool. I gotta say, pretty neat. Let's go. Made a bridge. Let's have a look around. Watch it make a bridge. Hmm. I mean, six bucks is hardly a bunch of anything, really. magic something must be different it's a big door these 
Is it never a welcome sight? At least I know what to expect this time. some straight up diabolical puzzle work Rebellion. that's what i expected okay yeah no this is kind of more of what These i expected look familiar. this is a lot more of way more like on point kind of bullshit i thought he'd be in for Such great progress. Oh my god. What is it? <gasps> it's a dumb innocent hat. Woo! I'm so excited about this damn hat. You have no idea. This hat, it means everything. Everything. Okay. Um, it looks like it also changed the very environment around us. Oh, I'm super down with. Oh. Thank you. With that shot. What did that burst of magic do? Perhaps I should examine things from both sides of the archway. I mean, you can. You certainly don't have to. That didn't help. Town could have told you that. The question is, how do you get out of this room? Men. Okay. Ginger. Okay. Ginger. <sighs> More statues. Ah. Ow! I didn't even see that one. What? Ah! Ah! Uh
Ah, no. God damn. No, this is a trial. They're not going to take it easy on us. We're supposed to be better at it. I'm not terrible. Just, I feel like I'm actually supposed to use both of those really good, and I'm not. Like, I should have eight skills that I'm constantly able to use. Instead, it feels like, uh, you know, I got like two or three, maybe. I don't see anything this is supposed to connect to. Maybe I have this backwards. Life is a garbage campfire. Sometimes I'm honestly convinced of that. Ah, the big door. Oh, thank God. Okay, let's do it. Big door time. Did it work? Did that fix things for you? No, it looks like that made things worse for you. Um, let's try this. Seems I ought to explore this archway from both sides. These. Oh, okay. No, it is. It's blown up. Okay, what so. Did that burst of magic change on both sides of the archway? It gave us this. Something Don't worry. I see, it. I see it. I see it. Just relax. Tara is agitated. She wants more progress to have been done. It's like, geez, Tara, give me a break here. I'm trying. when I move in and out of the archway. Yes, yes. How about we go blue then? What's, what's that done? Does that help me? It did. Alright, good. Excellent. Okay. Go back through red. Now the giant fucking bridge should be there. Nope. Go through red. The giant fucking bridge is there. So that's it. I need to use both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side of the bridge. Precisely. <coughs> and now that we have... Now, men. Now, dear one. What what have you done? Jin. Ginger. Ginger. Dear. Dear men. Over here. Bump. There we go. So that's it. I need to use both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side Tara, of the bridge. Tara, it's fine. Got this. Tara! Oh my god. She let me down. She let me down. I can't believe it. We were that close and she let me down. I'm very disappointed. Tara, get up here. Don't let me down. Excellent. Excellent. All right. So that's it. Just I need to use both sides of the archway to Tara. get the platform to Tara, the other Tara, side. Tara, you're killing me. I 
understood instantly. I just wanted to be a guy who can get the box. That's all. Just wanted the box. I'll never get used to these fools. Eh. These things are obnoxious. But fair. Back up on this. Uh, nope, not even close. So much for your trial. You guys are the ones who chose this location. What were you thinking? All right, let's try and really devise like the perfect tools for these. Cause that's not doing it. Um, Nothing but heavy shit. Just like all the heavy shit. Just do all the heavy shit. I'm right. Just with the heavy shit. Can't. I'm not allowed to be up here. Look at this. Flattened out the ground. Like, impossibly so. Like, flattened it perfect. It was like a perfect combo. Yeah, jump up here. God damn. That really fucks him up. Oh. Alright, let's try that again. Dang, that is the way to do it. And the game glitched really hard just now. <laughs> oh no, it might not let me save. Fantastic news. It will not. Locked on? No, it's because the game is glitched. Yeah, the game glitched out because of these stupid stairs that I'm standing on. Restart from last save. You killed all of your enemies, um, technically. I don't see any reason why. I shouldn't be able to just be back. Yeah, exactly. Like, they're dead. Perfect. Never get used to these fools. No, they're dead. And they're alive again. Okay, that's suck. That is suck town. Alright. Fuck it. That's what glitched, by the way. Then trying to summon those three little guys. That absolutely is what broke it.
Come on. You can suck it. So rude. You wait your turn. Back off. Nothing but red. I guess that's the ultimate form that I can take against those in particular. It seems like the only thing that did anything. Like, I've tried everything else. I've tried Lavosio, Lavosa, I've tried every single other goddamn thing I can think of. I can't. I just can't. It's the only way. I don't think there's anything Good here idea. for us. Yeah, this is just a room of suck. Alright, let's get on the platform. What? What is it? Okay. It's good. I feel like I made it back to the exit at least. <laughs> like, it feels like I just walked in a big circle, truth be told, but maybe that was the trial. Ooh, now that looks like a trial. It looks like a giant Merlin trial. Maybe it is. Don't like the look of this. Ugh. Big bubble. Strike him down. Tried to dog roll it. Oh my god. Stop it. Less than half. Guardian. Get big passes. I don't like that. 
What is that? God damn. Just pay attention to me. Guardians, dude. They are a uh, fucking force to be reckoned with. God damn. I'm gonna hit them with my best stuff. Like, didn't mean anything to them, it felt like. I just blasted and blasted away and just didn't seem to do anything. Holy crap. That felt like a trial. Okay, now I feel a little more confident that we are actually I'm done with the trial. Oh. Hey, big guy. Didn't notice you at first. Oh. Distinguished Amber Cloak. Well, I like a cloak. Touch it. Yeah, we'll touch it. I mean, we earned this pen seat, I feel like. And yeah, it looks bad. It looks, it looks like we're gonna die. It looks like he's gonna wake up, he's gonna slap us down. With a giant Dark Souls esque boss hand. Go ahead and touch it. Considering there's only eight main quests, which is sad, not very many, this feels like it was actually pretty significant. So let's see it. Your ability to transfigure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? I want to transform people too. In not just the way they are, I don't think but the way they think. It's like, um... It is agonizing to that's see a very disturbing line suffer. of conversation you're starting. It's like, I want to change you. everyone. The pain of losing you is <laughs> now as if it happened. Is he? She's gonna turn out to be evil, right? She's, she's bad. He doesn't need pretty I swear to God, right? He needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? What if you I could so kill everyone I didn't like I with my special new powers? Pain. <laughs> she started just it laughing tempting, like, oh shit. To use this magic that you're mastering to yeah, transfer the world the you're teaching world. somebody how to use nuclear power, but emotion is a potent force unto itself. Oh lord. Oh no. Even the most well so I'm the second attempt. Witch I'm the much more grounded the second attempt. Of irrevocably manipulating it. Oh, so Lordy. I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys You're to watch him. as my father dies a plebeian it is death not your pain when I could take. kill all his enemies for him. It's like, just chill. Just chill. Please don't do this. Please don't turn evil. Please don't be the one who's like, I'm going to use my gift for evil. But I think she is. Every year a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana, welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm -hmm. Professor Rickwood? I was so, so pleased to hear that you accepted huh? the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor. Sit, so she sit, did Isadora. Go. Tell she us about go your now. Good for her. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. There's much Bit of a I'd trap like I set up for that you. Would be delightful. It we is going to be delightful. Very well. <laughs> and then the tea will be served, and then the claymores will go off at their knees, Mother and then Mary. I will Mary have the power, she says. Uh oh. Oh, jeez. Well, return to the map chamber. Oh. Oh, how convenient. It opened a sweet door for me. That must be the way back. Boop. It is. It's a shortcut. 
dude, the game is like, Behold, you are back. Like, fucking immediately, like, zap, zap. What have we here? Oh, nice. We got our second I guy. I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir. And this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I have, Professor Rookwood. We saw you in the Pensive, in Gringos, with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that Pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last Pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You'll need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. What kind of journey? Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? No. Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. Oh. The goblins? The, the student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. Goblins. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, <laughs> not only encountered goblins lurking outside yeah, of Sandakar's tower, they also encountered we'll a him. powerful goblin we'll in my vault goblin. at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would yeah, be wise Gert to hold goblin. the trials until we know more. I will tear we shall defer down. to you in this matter, of course. Now then. Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Do you think that there's a connection to Victor? Uh-huh. Perhaps. I do. But we can't be sure of its significance. Well, I do notice For now, things. Tell me what you saw a in professor. the professor. Before says. the witch from the last pencil, <laughs> Isadora became a Hogwarts professor. She argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest, I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Free Broomstick speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies, yes, sir. Uh, before you go... Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along Not our really. path? Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out This guy's a bit of a pompous ass. I like the one in the middle better. If I had known that was it, I would have taken a screenshot. I thought that we were going to get to see something. So this is my room. Wow. I, like, never get to be here. Hello. So much mail. Good owl. Yeah, this is my room that I'm never going to find again. And yeah, it's the one with the crystal ball in it. And he's all like, oh, don't neglect your studies. And it's like, what are you talking about? I have done so much. Oh my god. Let me just, let me just, for a second. Goo oo naboo. What is this? Broom racing. How do I. Um, you know what? I'm looking it up right now.
also no there is a special quest that you do need to find in order to be able to even yeah beast class that's where we need to go oh my god oh my god this is how we do it this is it it literally i just predicted that let's go um i think no, no, uh, well, looks like it's messy far. Whatever, it's fine. We'll go down here from the tower. I wish having a broomstick had more applicability. Like, I'm in the tower. Hmm. And then I flew out of the tower and just met him down there because I have a freaking broomstick. But no, there are very specific places you get to fly. Creepy. Please see me after class once you have completed the tasks I've set for you. What? I would like to teach you Descendo, useful for pulling objects to the ground. Well, isn't that helpful? When does that ever Someone come up? Glad I'm getting spam mail though. So glad I have sexy sunglasses now. Ugh, what am I missing? All right, we are on our way. Going to beast class. Uh, mm -hmm. This is ultimately how I do believe I would get to have beautiful beasts. Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent, outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class. For Summoner's Court isn't just a game, it's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. For I'd say. Not right this Perhaps second, but I'm very scared of losing. Wow. <laughs> Suit yourself. I guess I'm the champion around town. People stepping to my mad skill. Like they think they got something. We'll see. But I'm not about to tarnish my reputation. Let's play Summoner's Court. I knew you'd come round. Ready to go? I am. I'm in. Let's do it. Brilliant. Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Summoner's Court. Okay. Oh yeah, that looks terrible. Dude, you did just terrible. Nice. Okay. On, oh. That was one for the ages. I mean... Your turn. 
<laughs> oh, nice. Try to be that. Gone. Dead, dead, dead. I've seen one. Yeah, fire it up. Oh my god. Interesting. He's trying to block me. All in the wrist. He is, he's trying to block me. Wait, did I win? I won! Crap! <laughs> Even he didn't believe. He's like, wait. Did I win? I just won! <laughs> this beautiful bastard. Oh, I almost want to let him have it. Let's play some of his cards. But I can't. I knew you'd come round. Ready to go? Champion must I'm be in. a champion. Let's do it. Brilliant. She is Josem. Summon is cool. The ever-changing game. Oh, your turn first. Fire it up. Okay. Much better shot this time. Dang, good shot. All right. Nothing to it. Crap. Nice. He upgraded me. Eh, lucky shot. You have that one. Well done. You beat me. I did. That was a close one, though. Good game. It's got competitive. Bit of good luck. That's all. No need to be upset. Come now, Leander. There's no need for that. It was a good game. Fine. You're good. Better than I am, at least. I'll let the others know you're good enough to keep playing. The others? I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. The others oh. who play Summoner's Court thought that if you couldn't beat me, you wouldn't be enough of a challenge. Wow. Chin up, Leander. Keep practicing and you'll get better. I suppose you're right. I'll let the others know that your metal's been tested and that you passed. Well, fantastic. I dare someone else to challenge me on the Summoner's Court. It's... Uh, I hate to admit it. It's, it's super fun. <laughs> it is. It is. It's ridiculous how fun it is. Now then. Cladwin Moon. Beast class. Oh god, yeah, it's beast class. Send me to beast class. Oh god, I wish they would let me use a freaking broom. This'll work. Yes, yes. What are you up to now? Beast class. That's what. Well, yeah. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them oh properly. No. Now, it seems many of you are out of do -do. practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Yes. Miss Sweeting, 
Would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweetie. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! oh. Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, <gasps> yes, Professor. Here, you can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> what do I do with him? You can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it in rich. Boop. Experience. <laughs> That's I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? Beast feed, she says. What oh do you my suppose gosh. the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. <laughs> I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. So cute. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition. And cleanliness. Ambition. Good work, everyone. Now, let's He's make our way poop. to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way, the measles are over here. Some sort of beautiful cat beast. Oh, couple of measles whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jeeks. <laughs> Careful now. Oh, stupid thing. Oh. What are you doing? Ugh, tuss, tuss, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone! <laughs> Her name is Persephone! <laughs> That's really not funny. I really <sighs> hate animal abuse. Take him down. Let's go. Can I duel him? Oh, Persephone. It's a giant, beautiful pug face kitty cat monster. I love him. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Poachers and training. Persephone was onto them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one, as do I. There. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves Aww. out. Now, where is our new student? Ah, there you are. Hello. I would like a moment, please. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast's lesson? Upsetting, but adorable. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good! You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Right? Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Ugh. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling have over dead beasts. Most of those guys. Terrible waste of resources. At least all the Surely ones the found. poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The ministry, perhaps. Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now. Why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? 
Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. I wish I could. Thank you. Hey, over here. Come on. Did you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least, that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. You've intrigued me. Very well, lead the way. I'd hoped I would. I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. <sighs> Quite the work you have you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better than I just do. Don't mind me collecting some stones. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. Stand back. Hippogriffs, the proper courtesy yeah, be before you approach them. Oh, there it is. <laughs> nice. You can approach. I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed the brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties, tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. There you go. <laughs> Cute. What did you think of Highwing? Wow. I thought she was brilliant. I mean, she's really pretty. I can't pretty. believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? So I've seen cool. it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story. But I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again. And I might not be there next time. Professor Howard mentioned the poachers as well. She seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but yeah, on that, I kill. fear she's right. The poachers' <laughs> killed a lot of poachers is growing. So far. I see them every day in the village, lingering, you. talking to people. <laughs> They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. 
Okay. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power, and the more I know, the better I can keep hiring safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Yes! Oh, did I actually gain the abilities? Oh yeah, no, this is like its own skill set now. Yeah, totally. To like conjure this, conjure this. Dang. It means I need a new thing, like a new way to uh, have all these skill set on it. Hmm. It's a good quest though. class. Practice flying. That's it? What? What happened to all my other quests? Huh. Alright. Where do you think divination class is? Okay, wait, wait. Better idea. Ten divination clubs located on map. Ah. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. There. What's you unusual about that? Like, he's lost. Of course. Trying to find a way in here. Ironically, I didn't see ahead of time how bored I'd be in divination class. Is that sea bass, by the way? God, I hate sea bass, if that was. Did she give him a vision? I hope those are I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. What was my Although tasks? I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, well, what were my tasks? as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I, don't remember what I am curious, based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal yeah. traces of what is to come. What Maybe. do you see in your own future? Um... Huh. I honestly sure. don't know, Professor. At times, the future is murky to us all. 
As with rippling water, one must wait for things to settle before the reflection becomes clear. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Channel your magic towards your targets. Why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? I suppose. Excellent. Wow, that looks violent. <laughs> Professor, do you have a moment? I do. I was wondering how you decided to teach divination. Ah. The art of divination is an important yet often misunderstood branch of magic. Those of us who possess the sight are rare. And, as is often the case with the unique among us, we can frequently be misread, even feared. When I was granted the opportunity to teach others about my gift and the good it can do, I was most grateful. I see. Natty told me that you and she moved here from Uganda, where she had attended Wagadu. Yes, Natsai and I both loved Uganda and Wagadu, but we are happily settled here now. I had foreseen such a change, but did not know the details until it occurred. I was glad of the outcome. You would be wise to remember that the consequences of our actions are complex. And so, divining what is to come is not as simple as gazing into a crystal ball or studying the bottom of a teacup. I find it truly intriguing, even if I don't fully understand it. <laughs> intriguing. That is one word for it, world, so and I'm certain you will come to understand I wish many things more deeply I could just in the make days food show up. You are a student <laughs> That's, Hogwarts, like, impossible. It could not have escaped you that we in the wizarding world yeah, are forever navigating around my house. the People are like, I have no idea where your house is. Of course, like, Professor. Really? Now, I know that you can, we with both a giant white have fence that I'm describing in the message on the profile, you, it'd be you, easier. But because I am a professor and you one. are a student, I have enjoyed our conversation. I am a student. Sorry. Just, wow, everyone left in the time it took for us to have that conversation. Have a good one, dummy. Another adventure, are we? I think this person 
I'm not sure if um, they're actually able to read these messages or not, because I went step by step on how to get there, and now they're just like completely across town. I don't know what's going on. It's like at some point, you know, you just have to let it go. It's like it's being carried around by a bird somewhere, and you just hope it lands near you. If it doesn't, well, that's too bad. I hope I can get my money back for it. I just have to accept it. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Ooh, music got sinister. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, Drunk. unsteady when we last met. Yeah. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not! And uh, from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that curious statue over there? Yeah, I do. Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Wow, are you telling me it's... We just waited here an entire day. What? Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Ooh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Here. Which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Uh, ever okay. since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. I've been seeing them. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, <laughs> that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you Sure. Uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. Yeah, your deepest fear. This one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? The thing? <gasps> yes! Terrifying thing. creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demiguises. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired place. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have oh. my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels. Scallywags. It is more right? that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. Dirty that is why I need your help in removing the statues. I'd love why to do that. I've been wondering. A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. I do. I do. Second, as macabre and idiot as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. <laughs> In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them, so uh, I can go about my evening duties. Huh. Fine. I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? I don't know how you'll to open that door. You'll want to do that before that wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However, will you get in? I don't know. Alahamora, that's how. But what about oh, curfew? Curfew? Please. I sent you a bit like, you me like when I was your you, please. Oh, the school was my oyster. And I took advantage of it. 
Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. I don't even know how to get to the hospital wing. I guess that's part of his route or what have you. That's a lock, all right. Anywhere now. Finally. And the final big weird mystery. The big fuzzy statues with a moon. I've been wondering about. Thank you. Alohomora. Bam. Oh my god, it's a minigame. What the fuck? Are you serious? I'm not ready. Okay. I'm gonna eat. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm not ready. And then uh, I will love to figure out this new minigame. The minigames have all been fun. Maybe I underestimated how many story missions there are because it feels like this was all stuff I was supposed to have gotten to do a long time ago. But I'll be back later.